If you've been driving anywhere in the coastal bend recently, you've probably seen political signs at several street intersections and along county roads. But do they help candidates? Intern reporter Ivan Sotelo has some insight. Political road signs, we all see them. With the general election around the corner, it's hard to avoid them. But at what point, many may ask, does this battle for sidewalk space turn from advertising to an eyesore? We met with Dr. Kevin Kearns, Associate Professor of Political Science at Texas A&M University, Corpus Christi. If there was a benefit to the road signs, my understanding would be it would be just getting your name out there, right? So that could be useful for candidates that aren't as well known or running for offices that people aren't as familiar with. Familiarity and brand awareness, that is the big reason, says Dr. Kearns. Aside from political affiliation, how much the voters can recognize a candidate plays a massive part in how many votes they can receive. But in a race where 30 signs are in a row down a street, how much impact can be made? Political scientists who examine this, by and large, many of them would argue that it doesn't matter. What the prevalence of signs or signage, it might reflect enthusiasm, but that doesn't necessarily translate into more people voting. Because of this, one can hope that alongside these signs, these politicians and candidates are making enough impact in the community to get their names out there, especially since many signs do not indicate a particular political party. This is intern reporter Ivan Sotelo for KEDT News.